Pete is, he's just a boy who, he's a normal boy, but what happened was he was in a car accident in the beginning of his life when he was only four years old or so. And he, he, his parents died and he didn't have anybody to talk to except him. And then he went out into the forest and he found the dragon, which changed his life completely. Another big thing that changed his life. And then he grew up with a dragon Young Pete is being chased by wolves at that point. He gets, he gets, uh, he's just, wolves just find him and try to track him down. But he, so he's just running and running and running. And then he stops and he sees this giant majestic dragon and he, he kind of, he just, he changes Pete's life and Elliot helps him out. Pete thinks that he might be in trouble with the dragon, that his dragon might eat him or something. But instead the dragon's nice and he helps him out and makes him live a better life. Pete feels like he doesn't really understand where he belongs because after he sees how nice some humans can be but how mean some others, it, it can make it a little hard for him to understand. And uh, I think he doesn't want to leave Elliot at all. He, he loves Elliot like a brother or a father, like all in one, but he, He's not as kind, and he's become very close with the other humans, and that kind of makes him feel like he might need to live with the humans, but he doesn't want to leave Elliot. Una, she's, I think she's having a lot of fun, and uh, she's also been doing a lot of stunts, and we, uh, have a lot of fun off screen too, playing video games, going to playgrounds, doing adventure stuff, yeah. Um, but it's just, she's really nice, she's, she's a really good actor and I think that we've been having a lot of fun working together.